How did you end up at USC? So it was a fall day um, in 1967. My dad and I are sitting in the uh, in the living room, <clears throat> and we're watching a college football game. It was USC playing UCLA. The winner of that game was going to advance to the Rose Bowl. Very captivating uh, time because it was a capacity crowd in the Coliseum. Um, there was this pretty average running back at the time. I don't know if you've heard of him. His name was O.J. Simpson. He he took the ball and cut to his left, raced back to his right, and went on for a 64-yard touchdown run to win the game for USC. And it was the combination of that run, it was the enthusiasm of a, of a capacity crowd in the Coliseum, but what really captivated me was this beautiful Arabian white horse with a with a Trojan mascot galloping around the Coliseum floor after, you know, OJ makes this run. And I'm I'm fifteen, you know, fifteen years old <clears throat> or so, uh, maybe sixteen. And I'm I told my dad, I said, That's the school I'm going to someday. Now, mind you, <laughs> I'd never been out of the state of North Carolina before. <laughs> I'd never been on an airplane. In fact, I'd never been on a bus. <laughs> and I told my dad, I said, that's the school I'm going to. And he said to me, he said, boy, you have lost your mind. What are you talking about? So... As I graduated from or was about to graduate from high school, there were other colleges that were uh, interested in signing me. There were local colleges there in Greensboro, North Carolina A&T, um, North Carolina State, University of North Carolina. There, there were a number of different schools that were uh, interested. In fact, there was a guy that came up from North Carolina Central and said, uh, you know, uh, Vince, we'd love for you to come to our university. Told me all about the school. My parents were, uh, we were sitting in the in the living room, and uh, the guy was making his presentation. and And the thing that was in the back of my mind was was USC. And so I respectfully told the gentleman, you know, thank you so much for coming up, but uh, I'm going to decline your offer. And so my dad really thought I was crazy then because he couldn't understand how I could turn down something that was, you know, concrete and right there in front of me for something that was, I'm sure he considered as a pipe dream. And so concurrently, um, my brother, Tyrone, and another friend of mine uh, from Greensboro, Perry Nichols, who were venturing out to California, they actually uh, they came out to California just to sort of pursue their their dream, and you know, um, so they called me. And my brother called me and said, "Hey, Vince, I, I think, man, you can really make it out here in in California because they had been here and saw the caliber of play." And uh, uh, <clears throat> and so I came out to California. I had fifty dollars. In fact, it was my mother's last fifty dollars. My parents were both school teachers and probably made about four thousand dollars a year back then, raising four young men. And uh, uh, she gave me her last fifty dollars, and I had a one-way ticket, which cost ninety-nine dollars, and came to California, scared to death. Uh, like I said, never been on an airplane before. I had one suitcase. Came and stayed with. Uh, <clears throat> Uh, my friend's aunt, Perry Nichols, his aunt was gracious enough to allow me to stay uh, with her, uh, enrolled in Los Angeles City College, and uh, and uh, uh, played there for one year. We went to the, uh, uh, the all-time great Potato Bowl up in uh, Bakersfield. <laughs> <laughs> And there were, you know, as you 
may recall, you know, junior college football was was really uh, big at that time, and and uh, and so we we played in the the game there, uh, the Potato Bowl, and after the game was over, I was um, was elected as the most valuable player, and and uh, there was a scout that came up to me from USC. His name was Willie Brown, and uh, Willie said, uh, Vince, we would love to have you to come to our university. <laughs> I was like, do you have the letter of intent? I'll sign it right now. And uh, it was just really overwhelming. You know, it was, it was a boyhood dream come true. Uh, and uh, when I, you know, when I got that news from Willie that he wanted me to you know, come to USC. I called my dad up, right? And so I said, Dad, man, guess guess what happened, man? He said, what happened? I said, uh, I got an offer, man, to go to USC. And he said, boy, I know you could do it all the time. <laughs> said, yeah, right. So he, you know, we've, we've since laughed about that, and he was saying that, you know, I was using that as a motivation. I said, "Yeah, right." But it was uh, it worked out, and and uh, so that that's how I got there. Man, that's a, that's a great one there, Ben. 